Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna show you um, four Lego guns that I think looks absolutely awesome. Before we start in, I should let you know that you guys are the best viewers in the world because I wouldn't be able to make my channel without you. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get into it. First up, I'm gonna show you how to make a really cool sniper. This is the sniper. I'm gonna be showing you how to make a really cool design. And what you're gonna need for it is one of these new like studs with a axle coming out of the top. New piece, really useful. A black cylinder. And a alien shooter gun. And you could use this as this is awesome optional if you don't have brick arms. This is a brick arms antenna piece. If you don't have brick arms, you can just use a four stud long pole that's smooth on all sides. But um, if you don't have that, this, you can order it off Amazon or anyway for 11 bucks. Brick arms, really cool and really useful. And I'll show you how to start building. So, I'm just trying to arrange my pieces here so that you guys can see them. Oops, there we go. And now, what you're gonna do, first you're gonna take this alien blaster piece, if you didn't see it quite right, it looks like that. Really cool. And you're gonna take the cylinder, you're gonna attach it on the front. Like that. Then you are going to take your four dot smooth piece or your antenna and stick it part way in the cylinder front. That way it looks like that. Then you're gonna take um, your, your um, crazy cool new piece and you're gonna place it right by the handle. So it looks like that, little magazine. Really cool sniper and I like to use it a lot. Next up, I'm gonna be showing you how to build this epic rocket launcher. And what you're gonna need is a movie camera piece and a transparent glass stud and a black stud. That's all you're gonna need. But the movie camera piece, it's very rare. So if you find one of these, don't keep it in a special place. How, what you're gonna do, you can decide right now, you gotta make a decision if you're going to wanna make this the, the front end of your bazooka or this the front end of your bazooka. If you do this for the front end, you're gonna need to take this black stud, clip it on the front, and then take this transparent stud and clip it on like that so it looks like a movie camera. That way you can line your character's eyes up through the glass and make them go kaboom. If you decided to do the opposite way, you will not need this black stud and you will only need this glass piece. And the glass you're gonna place on the opposite side of the side scope so that, hold on, so that it goes like that. And you will not need this, but you can add it if you want. And boom. I like it like this better because it looks more like an elongated barrel. And then have your minifig, hold it by the handle, and you're off to the races. I'm saving the best for last. And next up is a minigun. What you're gonna need for this build is an alien blaster pistol, a cylinder, a cone, two black studs, two, um, two one by one plates, oops, two one by one plates, and one of these one by one plates with a out branch for sticks. That's all you're gonna need to make this really cool minigun. First, what you're gonna need to do is you're going to need to take the alien blaster pistol Hold it upside down. And what you're gonna need to do first is we're going to need to take one of these one by one by one um, squares and put it on the front. 
Then you're going to need to put one of these axle, I'm just going to call them axle heads for this one, and put it so that it's facing down like that. And then you're going to put another one by one square on top of that so it kind of makes like a sandwich. Next up, you're going to put on a, the cylinder and then the cone in front of that. And then for the drum, you're going to put on your one by one studs on either side of it, and boom, a combat ready minigun. I saved the best for last, but you're going to be making this round is an Armageddon um, minigun. This, um, I mean, fortified turret. This is really cool design, and this is portable. So your minigun, so your minifig can either um, have it mounted right here and shooting in a 360 rotating axis or carrying it around as a fallback weapon. Really cool, really nice design. This one does take a little more pieces than my previous one does though. What you're gonna need is these inverted handlebars, this um, clip, this horizontal clip, one by one with a horizontal clip, and a one by one with a vertical clip. And you're also going to need a black cheese wedge, a brick with the stud on the side of it, indented or outdented. I prefer the indented, it just looks cooler. One of these new pieces that's a one by one with a, um, with a little hooker on it. A black skeleton's leg. A cylinder and a telescope piece. What you're gonna need to do to assemble this, so and I need you to listen closely because building this weapon is not easy. What you're gonna need to do first is take the hor horizontal clip and then you're also going to need to take this and you're gonna clip it on like that and swivel that upwards so that it looks like that then you're going to take the horizontal clip and place it like that for iron sights if you're able to to shoot through then you are going to take your indented brick and you're going to place it on right there so that the whole part is facing upwards and then you're going to need to take your one by one piece that um that swivels and you're going to need to clip it on the back of that um on of the um brick with the stud on it then you're going to need to clip the Oh, hold on. I made, I did it backwards. Hold on. Uh, this is why I said make very careful attention. So take that apart. You're going to want to take your handlebars, clip it on so that the bottom side of this brick is facing outwards towards the minigun. Then you're going to need to take the iron sides, clip it on. Take your indented brick, clip it on. Then you're going to need to take your one by one and with the clip. Clip it on the front so it looks like that. And then you're going to need to take your cylinder piece, clip it on. Then you're going to need to take your telescope piece, clip it on. And then the next two parts, you have to take this and clip it on so the toes are facing towards the barrel and flip that up like that. And then you're going to need to take this cheese wedge and place it on the indented brick so it looks like there's a slope going up to there. This is really helpful and really cool. If you wanna see more videos like this, um, click a like. If you, if I get 30 likes on this video, I'll make this a series. Um, love you guys, thanks for being the best viewers in the world. Also to set this up, flip the leg out and place on a plate of any kind that has studs and feel free to twirl it to turn it into a battle weapon just f simply flip the stand up and let your minifig hold it hope you enjoyed the video
if you wanna if you want more of these videos then click a like 30 likes and i'll make this a series love you guys and see you next time see you next time